Hi, during the uh, lecture, we look at a problem to calculate the volumetric flow rate of water flowing through a, a pipe and then converted into a mass flow rate. So we have got the water flowing at the velocity of 10 feet per minute through a 6 inch diameter pipe. Okay, now this is this is going to I'm uh, going to solve this problem in details for you for those who had a difficulty to understand it. I'm going to simplify the problem by looking the, uh, at the uh, pipe as a, a cylinder. So we have got a cylinder here and diameter of the cylinder is 6 inch and let's say the height is um, 10 feet. Okay, so the volume of the cylinder is the height of the cylinder times the area of the uh, circle or the cross section of the cylinder, which is A. So the next step is to calculate the area. So I'm going to basically draw the cross section of the cylinder, which is a circle. Okay. And we want to calculate the area of this circle, which we know the diameter is 6 inch. I'm going to use capital D as a diameter here. So if we take that the radius is going to be the small d, so the, we know that the cap, uh, the area is pi radio, radius squared. Okay, so and radius is diameter uh, divided by two or half of the diameter. So all I need to do is substitute there so area is pi bracket diameter divided by 2 power 2 that is pi d2 divided by 4 so it's very easy now to calculate the volume of the cylinder, which is height times pi times diameter square divided by 4. Now going back to our original um, problem, in this case we want to calculate the volumetric flow rate volumetric flow rate is about the volume per time so now we have got a time element so all we need to do is say our volumetric flow rate I'm using a dot there to show that is the volume per time and that is the area of the and uh, the cross section of the pipe times the velocity and that is That is 10 times um, pi times the 
the diameter of the pipe, which is basically uh, six inches or half foot power two all divided by four. So this way we have calculated the volumetric flow rate of um, water, which will be equal 1.9625 cubic foot divided by per minute. Now the next step is to convert this volumetric uh, flow rate into the mass flow rate. The relationship between the mass and volume is determined by density. So rho density is mass divided by volume. And we can use the same expression for the volumetric and mass flow rates. So again, density is volumet uh, mass flow rate divided by volumetric flow rate. Okay, so we know the volumetric flow rate. We calculated at 1.9625 and we know the density of water which is already given and that's 62.4 pound per foot tree. So we use these two and we put it in there to calculate our uh, mass flow rate. So if I do that, then the mass flow rate is density times volumetric flow rate. So therefore, Mass flow rate is 62.4 times 1.9625, which, if I put it in my um, calculator, that should give you the final answer of 122.4. Six pound per minute, which is the mass flow rate of water going through the pipe. So every minute, 122 pounds of water is flowing through that pipe. Okay, the next step, it will be a simple unit conversion of um, converting pound into kilogram and minute into uh, seconds, which that's equal to not 0.9 kilogram per second. So almost one kilogram per second is flowing through the pipe. Hope uh, this explained it better for you. Any problem? With this uh, particular problem, please get back to me and please join us uh, on our discussion board. See you later.